All right, guys, we're back for another Dokkan Battle video, and we got the data download with the Dragon Ball Heroes units live in game. So today we're gonna take a look at Super Saiyan Cumber. So you know, even though he has the long, you know, normal Super Saiyan three hair, you know, that's just Cumber's hair. Uh, he does have the eyebrows. He is just Super Saiyan Cumber, uh, and he does have a great ape transformation. Now, because of the fact that he's Super Saiyan Cumber, by the way, he is on the Super Saiyan category team, which is very good. Um, I've noticed his defensive status actually pretty low I, I just noticed that um now this this guy's pretty good uh number one he gets two key and 150 percent attack and defense at the start of turn uh that's pretty strong <laughs> and it's gonna be really nice for the giant transformation team which of course this guy's gonna be a big big part of um because on that oh he's in slot number seven beautiful i always love when that happens um, the Giant Transformation team is obviously one of these teams that badly needs buffs constantly, right? Um, okay. Uh, the other thing is that this Cumber does have Saiyan Roar. You know, being that he is a great ape character, he's got Saiyan Roar. So, we're going to want to get the GT Super Saiyan 3, uh, you know, Kid Goku uh, alongside him. You know, that's going to give him Sa Super Saiyan. It's going to give him Saiyan Roar. Um, I don't think that Goku has transformed. Uh, he doesn't have Shattering Limit. That Goku has Fierce Battle. And that Goku has Over and a Flash instead of Prepare for Battle. So they're not the best linking partners. Um, but that's why the two key that Cumber gets uh, just from his passive will be very helpful. Um, Great Ape Tora is another really good option uh, to pair up with Cumber. Now, obviously, uh, the Super Saiyan 3 Goku is going to give a little bit more um, in terms of stats. Uh, because, he, number one, he gives 3% more attack from his passive. Uh, but then he also will have the Super Saiyan Link, right? Which, uh, obviously, Great Ape Tora does not have. So, that's going to be very useful uh, with our boy Cumber. Um, probably the best rotation we'll see from Cumber, I think, is probably going to be uh, Turles. Uh, and then, of course, we will also have, you know, Super Saiyan 3 uh, GT Goku. And then, of course, we're also going to have um, uh, Cumber. We could have, I could have used... Uh, LRB pan as well with her active skill, but you know, you guys know how I do it. Like, you know, we do our, our initial video here uh, with the unit, um, and then, you know, once I actually get them in game and stuff like that, I will, uh, you know, rainbow him, uh, and we'll go ahead and take a look at what B pan does. So let's see uh, what attacks that Cumber gets right here. I mean, this is a pretty good rotation. You know, he is getting the Super Saiyan link from Vegeta, 40% attack from Turles, plus, of course, his 150% attack and defense at the start of turn. So. This is going to be Cumber. I, I imagine he's going to be over 2 million. I don't know exactly what his number is going to be. But again, I would assume it's over 2 million here. Uh, and he is at 1.6. Okay. So, Super Saiyan was active. He is greatly lowering attack. Uh, he's Okay, okay. I, I did want to see more from him than that. Um, I, I don't know what in particular he does special in his giant uh, eat form if he does anything special at all uh because we know like you know uh baby remember the great baby uh he does do some special stuff where you know he gets an additional key per orb um i'll probably actually just float off broly and paragus here uh since we're gonna have uh super saiyan 3 goku linked up uh we're, we're not gonna need the fact that taurus got saiyan roar uh now cumber his transformation is high chance when HP is 50% or below. So, again, as of right now, I don't know, like, if Cumber's Great Ape form does anything special. Because um, I, don't, I don't even think you can look at his card um, when he transforms, right? So, I mean, I guess he doesn't do anything special. I don't know why it's a high chance to transform, though, when under 50% HP if he doesn't do anything special, right? A bit odd, I would say. Uh, I think... Does Turles have tough as nails? He might. Uh, he doesn't have any extra attack links, though. So, all right. Um, this is going to be a better rotation for Cumber, obviously, because here we're actually going to have Saiyan Roar, um, which is a massive, what, 25% attack link. Uh, so he's up to 2.19. I mean, I'll take that. We definitely want to see his Great Ape transformation here. Um, that's one reason I'm in the Legendary Goku event. Because obviously, uh, this Goku will hit uh, hit us extremely hard, uh, so we can actually see this Great Ape transformation. But it is a high chance, so you know maybe we'll have a little bit of difficulty getting into it. Who knows? Okay, so 
Oh, yeah, perfect. There we go. We'll go ahead and let Tora get smacked around a little bit at the end. Uh, I don't think it'll be enough to kill us, but especially if that Goku super attacks, it definitely will be enough uh, to knock us below that 50% HP threshold so that we can actually see this Great Ape transformation. Because so far, Cumber seems good, but he's not like, oh, you know, Cum Cumber is so insane. Like, you know, I think Fu is better. Golden Cooler is better. You know, the Supreme Opai of Time is better. Uh, the STR Xeno Super Saiyan 3 Goku is better. Like, many units from this batch. That did no damage. Are you kidding me? <laughs> many units from this batch are better. Oh, his attack could still be lowered. We're not going to fall below 50%, I don't think. No, we're not below 50% because his attack got lowered. <laughs> all right, sure, 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 sure. Uh, all right, so this should be the same attack set that we saw last turn because, of course, uh, Broly and Paragus... They also give 40% just like Turles does. So this should be our, you know, 2.19 million attack number, which is good. I mean, again, no matter what, it's still nice to have, like, a new unit for, like, so many different category teams. Because this Cumber is on Pure Saiyans, Time Travelers, Dragon Ball Heroes, Giant, and Super Saiyan, right? So, like, just very valuable for, especially for, like, a free-to-play player. Um, and of course, you know, a new villain card. There's so, so few villains compared to how many, like, uh, hero cards there are in game, right? So it's always, like, nice to get uh, additional villain cards added into the game. Um, and uh, in particular, the giant team, right? Which is just so tiny. Okay, so what is Vegeta's defense here? Super high. Ugh. See, I can't put... If I put Turles in that first spot, he might get us killed. I, I can't... I can't put Turles in the first spot as much as I would like to. Hopefully, Goku will super attack right here. Um, we'll see. Yes, perfect. There we go. That's what we wanted to see right there. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> well, uh, showcases are always so frustrating for me. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Oh, boy. All right. Very good. Very good. We're, like, we're, we're at, like, 60% HP right now. It's like, I just want to see his giant transformation. That's all. And now... Oh, dude. Um... What's our rotation next turn? Those three. Okay. Honestly, I feel like this GT Goku... It would be a mistake to do that. He, he, he would get us annihilated. <laughs> that, that Goku, he would take way too much damage from, from an AGL-type unit. He is not, not a defensive unit by any means. Uh, hopefully, Super Saiyan 3 Goku will super attack here. I mean, if he supers Cumber or GT Goku, it's not going to make a big deal. 2.12, so uh, his attack set doesn't go that down that much uh, from Turles to this guy. Oh, but this Goku can still have his attack lowered. Bro. We're no okay, this is fine. This is fine. Because his attack was lowered. I could use a... Oh. <laughs> Alright, that was close. Um, I really wish I had a Princess Snake. I think I have a Ghost Usher. Okay, I think we're okay because I think I have a Ghost Usher. But it's like, yo, why, why does this always have to be so difficult? No way am I going to give all these orbs to Vegeta. Because Vegeta will, like, full heal us right here if I gave him all these orbs. Um, and I definitely don't want to take all this damage here. So, perfect. We can go Sesher. Um, if we don't transform next turn, I might have to heal, though. Which is going to be unfortunate. Uh, so, we'll do this. This will be fine. Uh, we'll go ahead and have Turles go. I, I guess we could just have Vegeta right here. Um, I actually do want to heal up a little bit. Yes, I do. Uh, I would not mind getting the... No, I don't want to get the Dokkan attack right here, actually. I, I do not want to do that, because if I get the Dokkan attack, even with Turles, Turles might heal so much health that we would move above 50%, but this is actually going to work good, because if we don't get the Great Ape transformation right here, we'll heal up with the Dokkan attack, and then hopefully we can take enough damage next turn, because I, I don't want to cut this video off, the showcase here, for Cumber, until we see his Great Ape transformation, uh, just because I want to see like what attacks that he's got, or if he gets any extra key... Or if he gets extra key from orbs or anything like that. Because right now, I don't know. He did indeed transform. Beautiful. Okay, that's very nice. Uh, all right, so he's not Super Saiyan anymore there. But then, oh, look, we're Super Saiyan now. <laughs> uh, honestly, I, I, I think that animation does look pretty good. Okay, so he, he's still giving himself extra key. That's really nice. 
Uh, okay, so we can actually take a look at his details here. Uh, he gives himself two extra key. That's good. That's actually really nice that he does that. That, that like, like, it might seem like, oh, no big deal, but no, no, no. <laughs> the fact that all, all, like, all these great ape cumbers here, they only have to get four key rather than six to super attack is incredibly helpful. So that's good. Um, let's see how much damage he does. Uh, 1.27 million. So, so it looks like around typical damage, uh, for great apes. But again, him giving himself that two key is nice. Uh, I do think this guy is going to be a very good unit again for the giant, uh, transformation team. I mean, as you guys can see, we are able to get a super attack with all three cumbers right there because like, you know, I was able to just get those two physical type orbs. So not bad. So there we go. There is our boy, super saiyan, great ape cumber. Um, he's good. He's not, like, unbelievably crazy, because I, I think, like, Golden Cooler and the Supreme Kai of Time and some of these other units are definitely, like, bro, like, wow, <laughs> they're, that's nuts. What's his defensive stat at right here? 94k. So, again, he's solid, very good even, but not, like, you know, one of these units where I'm going to be typing in, you know, best unit in the game as the title, like. You don't have to worry about Great, uh, great Ape Cumber here, but that's not going to be the title for him. Uh, we'll save that maybe for Fu. You know, maybe we'll bust out best unit in the history of Dokkan for Golden Cooler or for the Xeno Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Maybe that's what we'll do. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> so anyway, let me know what you guys think of Cumber. Uh, he's solid. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you all next time.